All right, I'm back down here again. <clears throat> this is that cut where I left off yesterday and I was getting all those coins. And uh, it's all filled in now. And actually the beach is different. There's all kinds of different dunes and stuff on this beach. But um, I walked all the way down here. I didn't get a signals. But as soon as I got here, listen. Let's see what it is. There were so many coins here that there's no way I could have dug them all. <laughs> I mean, I could have, but it would have took forever. First signal, a dime. And, uh, See, the waves died down today. Looks a lot less wavy. But here's one of the guys with the cameras. They got some major cameras down here. It's a really famous beach for bodyboarding, and body surfing, and surfing. Anyways, I'm gonna get back to it and uh, see what I dig up. Second signal, kind of a low tone. Let's see what it is. <laughs> I can feel my hole from yesterday. This is right where I was digging yesterday. Yep, it was a low tone. It was a nickel. All right, I'm gonna keep going and uh, I don't know if I'm gonna show all the coins though. I might just do low tones. Last dug a key, a uh, little tiny key. My last two holes I um, dug two. And I think I got two in this one. <laughs> yep. Look how crusty that thing is. But it's a penny. Those uh, zinc pennies, they really get crusty. And then a quarter. So I've been digging quite a few coins and I haven't even been here that long. there like hole there hole there there and there but each hole I dig down I dig more than one coin it's like multiple coins I dug like four out of that hole and I just dug that hole and I got two already and let's see there's still more so here hold leave it on I'm not doing a very good job taping because they are just coins. Well, I got one one bead already. Oh, that's my first piece of junk. Let's see what it is. <laughs> that's actually nulling out. I literally am not digging any junk in here. Looks like part of a lobster trap. And it is. I think that I've got out of this hole, besides a broken earring. Guess what? I just got gold. <laughs> um, I'm 
almost positive it's gold. Little bracelet. Uh, got a little bit of weight to it for the size. But the only problem is my detector barely picked that up. And it was showing. I mean, I, I threw a scoop right here on my pile because I'm just digging out holes now and just, I don't even hear signals. I'll dig down and I'll get signals. And uh, anyways, I threw it there and I could see it. And my, so I put my detector over and it just like barely made a little, little tiny waver in my pinpoint mode. But actually, I, I got the pinpoint mode first. I, I, so I did hear it first. I didn't see it first. It just went, oh, just a little tiny one in my ear, and I'm like, what the heck? What was that? So I went back and looked, that was, and I saw it in the sand. I was like, yeah, that's the whole thing. I was, thought I broke it, but it's right, there's that one end, and there's the other end. I see it says Italy right there. I'm really happy right now. <laughs> I actually pulled out my other camera. But look at how it is down here. Really nice. Very nice. All right, I'm going to keep going. <laughs> I wasn't going to come back here today because it was just ridiculous on coins. But now I got gold. I think I'm going to try digging down deeper in some of these holes and just see if the, you know, see if I get anything else. It's crazy. Here, I'll show you how my GoPro set up. That's how I normally tape. But it is so hot down here, I took my backpack off. My back is just getting sweaty. But see, it clamps onto my strap right here. And then, um, I could actually turn it up or down. So that's how my backpack camera works. Alright, I'm going to keep going. <laughs> that was pretty cool. All right, I'm moving on. I got out of that area where I got the gold. Well, I looked at it, it's 14K. Now I'm just wandering around. Wondering if I can get any gold. Ugh. <laughs> Jeez. All that for a penny. Peeny. I'll try to show some more. It's still not, it's not that calm like I thought it was. There's still some big waves out here. <laughs> wow. Wow, that guy got, wow, that guy got pounded. <laughs> I'm kind of far away from it right now, but... Wow, that was a good one. Kind of testing the camera, see how far I can be. And where you can still see what's going on. Alright, that set's gone. I'm seeing fish jump out there too, it's pretty cool. Just went in. I wasn't sure if they knew what they were doing, but I think they're gonna be okay. <laughs> oh well. I was hoping to catch one of those wipeouts. I'm up in the dry now. I'm going to go hit a different beach, I think. It's a pretty loud sound. <laughs> I had a feeling. The bottle cap. Well, I'm down here at a 
PB and J. I just dug this and a bead so far. I'm just killing time for because of traffic. Let's see if I can find the bead. There it is. Some little bead. But both in the same area, so I'll grid it out. I just dug that. Um, it could be gold. Little elephant. But I'm not going to check right now because I'm on my way out. Listen to this one. Sounds like a silver ring. That's good. I thought it was shallow. Alright, it's in the scoop. Come on. Let's see what it is. Ah, uh, uh, is that it? Ah, uh, that's gotta be it. Just a piece of aluminum or something. I mean, I guess it could be a, no, it's nothing. Uh. Right after that signal, I got this one. I don't know what that is. Looks like a coin. Oh yeah, there's a clasp for a necklace. But I don't know what the... Huh. Is this 25? I'll have to check that when I get home. Uh, huh. There's like a moon on it. it meant something to somebody. Alright. Um... Here we go for the wrap up. Um, sorry about the view of this, it's on a glass table. But uh, 10, 20, 22 pennies, 6 nickels, 6 nickels, uh, 10, 14 dimes, 1, 2, 3, 4, 425 and quarters. Uh, your basic junk here, bottle caps and stuff. I got a tank, PB and J. PB and J. Got a dog looking at me. <laughs> um, I got this bracelet. Another PB and J item. It says K on the little tag there. I don't know. It's pretty cool though. Um, I also got this. I didn't realize till just now when I was going through my stuff. There's a diamond in that. Probably not real, of course, but I'll have to check it out. What else do I got? It looks like a little bell or something. But there was a whole, um, it was like on something. I got two different beads, a uh, round one. And another one of those. I found some of these yesterday. Um, actually, I found one at PB and J and one at the other spot I was at. I got this coin on a necklace uh, on a thing. It's weird. It's got this gold thing attached to it. But the coin is actually, I believe, Pakistan, and it is a, a collectible coin. But it's not worth much. But hey, it's kind of cool to find that. Um, I got the elephant. I still don't know if that's gold or not. But it's still a cool elephant charm. It's like off a charm bracelet probably. Probably nothing. Probably copper. And then the find of the day. I got a 14 karat gold bracelet. Uh, it's not that big. And I'd be lucky to get it. Um, I just heard a little in my pile. Because I was throwing... 
each pile, I had to keep going read through my stuff because each time I dig some dirt out, I'd still have signals in the hole. So I'm just throwing dirt out, throwing dirt out. I mean sand. And then um, I'd go back through my piles and check them because uh, I was missing a lot of coins and stuff. But I wasn't missing them because I was going back through and checking. And I ended up getting gold. This is the kind of thing you'd miss with an ex cow. It only weighs three grams. Um, yeah, so that's it for this hunt. And I guess the tip of the day would be always recheck your area you're digging. Not only your hole, the whole area. Because stuff can pop out of your scoop, but you just never know. So double check everything. And that's it. All right, you guys, I'll catch you in the next one. I have to watch my brother today. That's actually why I'm out here doing my wrap up. I can't be back by my trailer. All right. Goodbye.